All right, we'll do the Lyman stuff real quick. Um, a few months back, I talked about my 270 dies, the uh, hash marks, and wasn't finished. The sizing dies basically wasn't finished. I destroyed the decapping rod, getting it out, but I was able to salvage it and get a few more size after I kind of cleaned up the interior wall of the die, but. I stopped using it. I was a little concerned and sent an email to Lyman with no reply. It's been a couple months. I sent a second email out, so we'll see what happens. Um, could have been in a spam folder. You never know. It may have gotten lost or whatever. But So the shop owner, I was talking to him. that sold me the dies gave me these. Um, so that's pretty cool. An older set of the All-American dies, 270 Winchester. So... But we'll see what Lyman has to say about that. I'm just going to send it back. Hopefully they replace it. If not, that's not going to look pretty good. So, anyway, on to the range report. A few weeks back, I took the uh, Lee 124 tumble lube out of my Taurus. And I was getting some keyholes um, with that round. And uh, I decided to take out the uh, Zestava M88 see if it did it with that plus I needed to get this out and run it for a little while have some fun with it and sure enough up here here and I'm pretty sure there that looks like two shots but I think that was a keyhole as well um, that was with a Lee Tumbaloo bullet so We'll get back to that load, see what if I can come up with a better one. And then down here, I was using my uh, pet load, my Acme, with uh, 6.3 grains of number seven with the uh, Zestava M88. Always fun to shoot that. She's got her issues, but she's still a good little gun. Uh, ended up finding some wood grips for it. Kind of figure out what kind of medallion I'm going to put in there. Don't know yet. Don't know what was in there for originally, so. Other than that, shot a little uh, 300 blackout. Um, no, sorry, this was the 357 loads. Um, first group uh, pulling the hammer back. Uh, this was um, double action. So, pretty good. I was using 125 grain, pretty warm load for a 125 grain bullet. Um, little soft point half jacket deal. So we'll get back to doing some more of that with the new pistol. So just a quick range report, guys. Um, here's the two 300 blackout loads. Um, the 136 grain mold from Jamie. Um, that was the first group, and that was the second group. With the little red dot, I was at 30 feet. So, not bad. Let me get my arm out of the way so you can see it. Not too shabby. A um, little fun day. Had a dead battery on the red dot, so I was lucky to have one in my bag and got it going. So, Alright guys, get out to the range. It's always a good day for shooting.